Hi guys, I'm Malika Valentine and this is my OMG interview. Currently working on some new music. Um, trying to release two songs this year as opposed to one soca that is. And well, the Calypso vibe, I'm definitely trying to go into the March of next year, 2018. So that's like one of my minor goals. I think my career really started off uh, Best Village, Larry Nivea, 2012 when I won and going on to starting really starting calypso monarchs and you know around the country regional and like national queens and stuff and then digital rising star is where i think i really had a debut because that was heavy following the fans and getting them to vote and that kind of thing so coming third in that show 2013 was when i was asked to be in the band in the company that very night uh, image was the backing band for the top three episodes so it was a whole experience working with them and then being asked to be a part of the band also the band has already been a favorite for me so it was an honor when joey Ningwai asked you know i'm like wow <laughs> this is cool because i was wondering what am i going to do now that i came third and i'm out of digital rising stars i was out of the show like what would be my next main step because every year seemed to be something so image and company frontline was the next thing and um that's when i won went on the win san fernando monarch 2015. so i started to adapt a, a trend trying to do something every year you know and it just became more and more exciting for me and building that fan base building that love people who then okay you may not have a song on the radio but some people follow you from the very beginning and especially if they see that you're constantly working on your brand that really helps so this uncovered thing is like what's happening now with me uncovered is a platform for any kind of a talent of most mostly singing where the million family get together and they decide okay every year we're gonna scope you know audition a whole set of people and come down to probably about 20 25 where they launch you you do a cover of a popular song two people do the same or however they do it and they launch videos they do different places they go around performing and promoting the uncovered brand and by extension promoting the young artists that are upcoming and haven't gotten a chance for people to see them or hear them so i'm very honored to be a part of it because they have a very organized team so i learn a lot being around them so we've been performing a couple nights at kites and blues cafe promoting that whole trying to get following and you know making the brand come alive again and it also promotes amateurs who want to come in as well so we are guest performers on the amateur night so it's, it's like a mixture of two things happening and really exciting yeah my dad has been working on my calypso for a long time right after the season he actually starts doing research so that even though they say you need to have current affairs happening there's always topics that you could develop from you from the beginning so from june he was writing and by july end i had my song i didn't start learning it until september though but it's all good um we're trying to think of the best way to promote it especially in the tent, which is like the big advertisement where everybody gets to see before competition mode, etc. So um, that's very exciting because we're in studio and ideas popping out, you know. Um, in this business, I think it, so far for me, my biggest lesson would be that you really have to have a tunnel vision and you can't allow other people's words or, or vibe to shake you because people will always be negative no matter what you do. So if you have a goal, you just go after it. So my OMG moment is definitely being hacked of my Facebook account and not being able to log in. Oh my God. <laughs> oh. Thank you everyone for viewing my OMG interview. And don't forget to check me out on IG, everything Malika Valentine, Twitter and Facebook. <laughs>